Okay, so now we're going to look at um, attaching a coat button or a jacket button. Coat buttons and jacket buttons tend to be thicker than the buttons that you would use for your shirts and skirts and things. To attach those, you can get special thick um, thread um, or you can just double up your home sewing thread like that. And I'll put the knot at the back um, to secure and we're going to first introduce it at the back and put the button at the place that you need it and we will then do the, the cross as before. Uh, there you go. So we, but what we're going to make sure we do this time is to leave that tension even slightly longer than in the shirt because we need to create ourselves a shank that will hold the coat in place. So again, do more stitches than I'm doing, maybe about four or five. I'm only doing a couple just to give me enough to, to work with. And you can see that we've got space here. So we move the thread around, but this time around, because we want to make quite a nice strong sack shank, we can do a loop, put your needle through, and then you're going to get lots of lovely, lovely um, strength on your shank. Cut your threads and that's your button on your coat.